Africa. What a beautiful night. Yeah, I'm freaking out now. I'm freaking out. That's really good. I how much you're actually supposed to put in there. Man, how beautiful is it out here? The lake is glass. I'm the only boat on it. going on everybody welcome to another in the out episode so as you can see we're gonna be doing a little truck camping we're gonna be doing a little trout fishing I'm super excited it's finally a beautiful day it's been snowing all week every morning sleeting on the way to work here the Sun finally came out I think we're gonna get to the lake in time to go fishing that's my plan anyway at least to give us two or three hours try to get a trout I'm hoping to do a catch and cook I have a meal planned if we get the trout but I need the trout to add to the meal or we're gonna go to the alternate meal. That's not gonna be that great, but it'll still be fun. It'll be a first for me and it'll be a first for the channel. So that's the plan. Get out in the woods, have a campfire, do some truck camping, do some trout fishing. As you guys can see, I got the kayak up on top. I'm gonna go back out in the kayak so I can get out in the water, travel around, try to find the fish. I think it's gonna be a beautiful afternoon. Sun goes down at about eight o'clock, so we should have a good two or three hours to fish this afternoon. I'm just trying to get to the lake, get set up, and get out on the water. So uh, stay tuned. This is going to be a fun episode, guys. All right, guys. We made it out on the lake. It's a beautiful day. It's just gorgeous. Uh, there's some fish rolling. I just saw an osprey pick one up. And then when the osprey took the trout out of the water, the eagle came in and tried to get the osprey. It was pretty wild. But we're gonna fish this little inlet up here. Um, I think I'm gonna start with the bobber just to see if we can get some action. So we're gonna set up right here for a second. I'm gonna get the bobber rod out and uh, see if we can get one on. Come on, Bobber, I'm gonna give up on you quick. We're gonna start trolling. There's fish rolling everywhere. They're super active. This Bobber might be too dead for them. Man, they're just jumping everywhere. Yep, I can't handle it. We gotta go to trolling. Can't believe that Bobber hasn't gone down yet. All right, we're gonna trade it in for the spinner. Man, there's fish jumping everywhere. Can you guys hear those fish jumping? Just everybody talking. All right, let's try this bad boy. All right, we're trolling. We're going right through them. We're rolling everywhere right now. Just need one for dinner. Ooh, ooh. Hit. 
hit. I'm gonna hit the whole thing. We gotta hit. Come on, take it. This keeps tapping. Come on. Bury that rod. Bury it. Come on, fishy. Take it. Ooh, we're getting we're getting bites. Oh, man, they're just hammering it. Dang it. Got on my worm. Heck yeah, I'm out on the lake fishing. This is awesome, there's fish rolling everywhere. I love this, I can't believe it. we're gonna truck camp tonight. Have a campfire. Fishies are biting. Just gotta get one in the boat. I even went and got a special little net for this tiny kayak. I could just get them, because I lost that one in the last episode trying to, trying to flip it. Come on, fishy, take it. We're gonna have to turn around pretty soon. Oh, there's one. There's one. There's one. No, where'd he go? How do you hit that hard and not stay on there, fishy? We just need one to bury. Might have got my worm. Okay, I gotta turn around pretty soon. Oh, come on. There was a bite. Go, take it. Oh, the river's biting. Come on, hit it now. Mm. Oh, come on. There it is. Oh, what do I got? A bad hook or what? Just about ripped the rod out of my hand. Come on. <sighs> no, we still got worm. All right, we're gonna turn around. I actually saw one like swim by a second ago. That's crazy. We're gonna turn around. Oh, just jumped out there. We are everywhere. There's nobody. I'm the only person on this lake. I think there's a couple hiking families out. Other than that, I am the only person on this lake. wonder about this hook. Oh, 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 there's one. There it is, there it is, there it is. There it is. Dang, it. Dang it. There we go. Oh, he's off. I even hit drag on him. Faster. There we go, fish on guys, fish on. There we go. Stay on baby. Oh, oh, oh yeah, he's playing. I don't know yet. Okay. Hold on. Oh, oh, oh don't get off. Get off. I'm sitting on it. Get off. Oh, there we go. Finally got one to stick. Oh, jeez. Look at that 
little guy. We're gonna let him go, guys. He's too tiny. Come on. We had to recess him for a while, but that guy's too little. Like, I could barely even get fillets off him. I know there's way bigger. I've caught big, big, big trout in this pond, so let's uh, go for a bigger one. Finally, one took it and stuck. Like, took it. I just gotta wait and quit touching my rod. All right, let's see if we can get a bigger one. We need a bigger one than that. You gotta just get too excited when they're just hitting it like that. All these fish are flopping around everywhere. Get your heart racing. I just love trout fishing. I think this is one of the reasons I love trout fishing. There's nobody out here. It's super intimate. Oh, there's a bite. Oh, that was. Oh, oh he's there. Golly. How can you rip it like that and not be on there? Little roach. Sometimes I wonder if this ultralight is too light and like it doesn't like really put a hook in them. Then again, I should have kept paddling. I should have kept paddling to help bury that hook. Dang it. But a big one will slam this thing. We'll know if we get a big one on. There's another fish. Oh, he's on there. He's on there. He's on there. We got another one on. Fish on. Ooh, ooh, this one. Ooh, this one feels better, guys. Here we go. Come on. Oh, this feels much better. Not peeling line on me, but feels like a way better fish. Oh yeah, there we go. Oh, there we go. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Oh yeah, we can eat this guy. He's, he's got way more life in him. Come here, buddy. Come here. Come on. Oh shoot, no. Oh, he took off. <laughs> yeah, this is a way better fish. Ooh, 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 ooh. Okay, sorry. He did not like the, ooh, baby. Let's go, come on. Ooh. Yeah, there we go, that's what I'm talking about. That's what I'm talking about, that's a fish. Yeah, let's go. Fish, baby, fish. Oh, that's what we needed. Let him bury it. Nice one. Oh yeah, slab. He's three times bigger than the one we just caught. Oh, hang on. I don't want to lose him. Oh, yeah. Oh, we had him hooked. Hooked, hooked. There we go. Oh. All right. Oh, no, 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 no. All right, guys. I am going to put him out really quick so he's not suffering. And I'll show you guys the fish. There we go. Now we got some fish to cook. That's a fish. That's a trout. That's what I wanted. That little guy was a third of this guy. Heck yeah. Wow. That's a way nicer fish. Look how bright. Oh, look at that thing shine. <laughs> yeah, let's go. Yeah, I'm freaking out now. I'm freaking out. Hold on. Hold on. Yes. It's so fun so fun man how beautiful is it out here the lake is glass i'm the only boat on it oh no there's a couple kayakers over there now never mind i lied but i feel all alone that is a good feeling especially after glamping and then doing the casino oh i'm glad to be back out in the woods by myself be by a fire with the truck tonight oh smells so good out here all right guys well i think i'm gonna uh head back in it'd be nice to get camp set up before dark and get this fish uh flayed out get the fire going and do all that stuff so we're gonna head back load the kayak up get this fishing gear cleaned up and then uh, get to camp and get it set up hope you guys are enjoying the episode uh stay tuned we're gonna do some cooking and campfire in here in a minute
right, y'all? I had to uh, get loaded up and get out of there. There was lots of boats coming in and out and out of the way. Um, just threw the kayak on top and uh, got here to a campsite. I'll show you guys in a second. I got to replace the battery in my uh, carbon monoxide detector. It keeps beeping. First things first. Have a Coors Light. God, what a beautiful night. Cheers, guys. I do have a special drink for the dinner. I'll show you guys that when we get dinner ready, but uh, I think we need to get the fire started, clean that fish. I gotta clean up camp a little bit, clean up my fishing gear. Let me get situated. Let's start the fire and uh, get camp set up. We're gonna clean this fish really quick. So I'm just gonna take the guts out because I wanna leave the head on for when I fillet it when we cook. And we'll fillet it when we get the cutting board out. So all you really do is start back here in the butt, go right up the middle of it, all the way up to the top, and you usually cut through the spine and then pull the head off, all the guts will come out. Like I said, I wanna leave the head on so I can hold on to it. Um, when we do it, but there you go. You just reach in and grab them. Get them out of there. Pretty much done. Wow, it's a good looking fish. Usually cut the kidney in here, this this bloodline you'll see inside of it. Cut it, take your thumb and just push it all out. There you go, one clean fishy. We'll take it out and fillet it uh, when we get ready to cook up. Get that little goo off there. All right, I'm gonna go put him in the uh, cooler.
think it's uh, time to start cooking. It's a beautiful night. The fire nice and warm, the sun's going down. I got my camp lit up. This is luxury. This is truck camps and luxury. Actually, I should name this video Luxury Truck Camping and Trout Fishing. Maybe that's what we'll call it. Might not be luxury, luxury to y'all, but I got a bed in there. The fire is so warm, cooking food. Luxury camping right here. This is what we're doing. We're gonna do fried rice with trout. So we're gonna uh, cook the trout. We're gonna fry the trout in butter with Johnny's, fillet it first. Then we're gonna cook the fried rice. We're gonna put the fried rice in the pan and do it up. And then I got sriracha, teriyaki, sesame seeds, and we'll do it up really nice, kind of like a um, Asian style fried rice and fish fried rice. So that's what we're gonna do. We'll see how it turns out. Uh, the special drink that I bought. I had to crack one, I'm sorry. But uh, we brought a little uh, uh, Crown Royal and Coke. So uh, yeah, love the purple drink. Haven't had it in a while. Saw it at the store and figured why not a little purple drink with the uh, fried fish, fried rice. All right guys, I'm gonna be honest with you. I just did like one of the worst fillet jobs I've ever done in my life. And <laughs> I'm pretty good at filleting. I don't know what happened. So I'm not gonna show you guys. But we're gonna chunk this up and uh, get it fried up nice and yummy anyway. All right, we're gonna get those sauteing. I brought butter and garlic. So we're gonna do butter and garlic. Back up butter and garlic, it's a stable. We got Johnny's for the fish, which I'm gonna put on right now. I heard that if you pre-season your fish, especially salt it, instead of doing it while you're cooking, it'll taste better. So, um, and then we have Johnny's for the fish, then teriyaki sauce, sriracha, um, some red chili flake powder, or chili flakes, and some sesame seeds. Season our fish, let that soak in there. I wanna get the water boiling so we can get the fried rice going and then we'll uh, saute the fish and garlic. some pretty good fried rice, huh? Okay. Looks like our water is ready. Let's go ahead and get our fried rice going here. Oh 
my god, that smells so good. Fish smells so good. God, what a great night. <laughs> it's a great night. Every night doing this is a great night. Love cooking and camping. Um, appreciate you guys following along. You like truck camping and uh, fishing, you like the video and the content, hit that like button for me. It help a lot. Those of you guys that are new here, maybe hit that subscribe button, follow along, get the updates. It reminds me a lot of just like growing up. I'm camping and fishing all the time with my dad. Except for the truck being so decked out. That's the luxury truck camping right there. Um, you know, we'd sleep on the tent and on the floor. Here we go. Fresh caught trout, catch and cook, baby, fried rice, oriental style, sriracha teriyaki, chili flake, sesame seeds. Oh man. Still steaming. Mm. <laughs> wow, just came up with it. Cheers guys, thanks for following along. Let me know what you guys think. Would you eat it? It's really good. I mean, it's really good. Mm. All right, guys. I am going to clean up. Um, hang out by the fire and then uh, climb into the truck, watch some TV and pass out. So I'll see you guys by the fire in a minute or two.
tired. Like, I don't know if I'm gonna make it through a movie. Part of me just wants to uh, just pass out. I would planned on watching um, some YouTube, but uh, but we'll see. Maybe we'll throw it on and uh, fall asleep with the TV on. But at night, though, I'm so full and content right now. Oh my! I'm so ready to hit this bed. Oh, it's been a long week. What would they give Steve a U-Haul? <laughs> Morning guys, 8.30, oh, it's freezing out, it's so warm in here, this bed is problems camping, I can't wait to do a road trip and uh, be able to sleep so good in this thing, uh, anyway, I'm not going to mess around this morning, I gotta get dressed. I slept in my boxes and I'm so comfy. <sighs> but uh, I'm gonna get up and make some coffee. I really want some coffee. Alright. Lights. Oh, there we are. Coffee cup is in the front of the truck. What a huge mistake. You guys would be proud of me. I even remember to bring water. Went and bought this little water holder. It's like $15. Is ice? Ooh. Ice. Yeah, it's cold. Do you guys see that? How often do you wake up and <laughs> see your breath? It's the Northwest, though. Man, we got that sunny afternoon, and I so enjoyed it. And I just know, like, I've seen the forecast, and the rain's coming back. Rain, rain, go away. Yeah, see it turning orange. And you can hear it, like, you guys hear that? Really cool. cool. One of the coolest little things I ever got. Oh, yes. Yes. I don't know how much you're actually supposed to put in there. I still want to put quite a bit in. I think we'll put two scoops. And the surprise. 
and I don't mind black coffee, but I got myself a little bit of a uh, powdered creamer. <laughs> so now I'm super excited. you guys following along on this one I had a great time uh, it was a beautiful night the trout were rolling everywhere the Sun was out the birds were singing the rod was banging the fish were on the meal was excellent the campfire was excellent the evening was excellent I slept great the coffee is wonderful this morning I had a lot of fun doing these episodes um, I hope you guys enjoy them and are able to get out and experience a little bit of what I'm doing out here and uh, I really appreciate you guys following along to the end if you're still here maybe hit that like button hit that subscribe button share it and uh, drop a comment I'd love to hear what you guys have to say and uh, just interact a little bit down there so I'll be in the comment section hope to see you guys there stay tuned for the next one and uh, until then guys I'll see you in the woods Definitely worth it to get out here on the water. This kayak is tiny. I barely fit in it. So, oh. You know what? I forgot my worms. I gotta go back and get the worms. Uh oh. Now we're in trouble.